I've been drawing ever since I was a kid, but I think I got more serious in fifth or sixth grade. For me, art is kind of like an outlet. I kind of use it to vent, like just the process of moving my arm to draw, to make something that kind of represents what I feel is like cathartic. I just was thinking of what I was going to do in my future and I didn't really think of anything else that I wanted to do besides art. So I wanted to get more serious about it. I do illustrations and I want to get into animation, concept art. So I try to do character designs and environment scenes. Kind of getting into like the online art community, which really opened my eyes to how good people can be at younger ages. So that's something that pushed me to try to get better too. Probably I want to get into, this is aiming really big with like Pixar or something like that. When I sit down and draw or paint, it's just, I can just let everything out and express myself through my art and what I create. I think that what I love most about it is it's so unpredictable. Ever since I was a little girl, um, my mom told me that I would sit on the stairs like with a little sketch pad and just call myself an artist and just be drawing all day and just have always loved it. I give credit to Mrs. Dalpra because she has always pushed me and always like telling me what I can fix, what I can improve. Just from being here for the past two years, I've sold a bunch of art and I'm like really learning how to market myself and how to turn it into a career. My ultimate dream would be to own a studio. So you just don't give up and even when you're really tired, you just have to keep pushing yourself. And you have to look at the ultimate goal and not just be like, oh, I'm tired tonight. Like you have to look two years from now, like where do you want to be? And you have to think of how hard you have to work just to get there. When I was a kid, my mom used to draw like Barbie figures for my sister and I. And so my sister and I started drawing people with clothes and we thought we were going to be fashion designers. Yeah, I thought it was really fun. Um, I didn't think that I would ever take it this seriously, but I think Miss Dahl has really inspired me to kind of test my limits and see what I can do with it. Art, I find, is a really good way for me to clear my head. I go to that class, focus on my artwork, and you kind of also see like the beauty in things when you're focusing that in detail. Yeah, it, you can really surprise yourself with what you create, so I think that's really cool too. This year, I got to submit five pieces for the Rockford Art Museum show. Three out of the five pieces I submitted were accepted, which really inspired me to kind of keep going and reassured me that I can do art and I'm not as bad as I might think I am sometimes. So that was a highlight. It feels great to be nominated. It makes me realize that my art really does matter. Art is kind of my way of getting away from everything and calms me down and it just keeps me in a good mood. I've always loved to just doodle and just color with anything. And coming to high school and having the art program here really brought it out in me, especially with the help of Miss Stockton. Because I came into my art class not really knowing how to draw or anything, I really focused myself in on working on detail. Um, one of my favorite moments was freshman year when I made a sculpture. It was put into the Rockford Art Museum art show. So coming from a middle school where art wasn't really my focus and getting into the show was very rewarding. And also the senior year, that same sculpture, it was sent to the state show in Chicago and I ended up winning the ISHAE Visionary Award for that piece. Well, it started just with doing like self-portraits and then I eventually like saw people do like this fine art and I got into it a lot. And I was like, oh, I'll mess around with like camera and photoshopping and it eventually just became something that I taught myself. Just whatever I'm feeling exactly or things that I've dealt with in my life, I take that and combine it with something to tell a story that, that it can speak for itself. I've done more with art here because the environment has helped me to open up a bit more than I would. I had a few photos published on Italia the Vogue's website and I also had two photographs published in Golden Age magazine and one I won the finalist of Photographer Forms magazine and it's going to be published in their book.